About 80% of road accidents are caused by human error, according to the National Road Safety Commission. These include speeding, overtaking and fatigue driving. My colleague Sarah Paku was at some transport terminals in Accra, where some long-distance drivers absolved themselves from blame. The increasing number of road transport accidents have become a major worry in the country. Some of the reasons have been attributed to the fact that some drivers have been sleeping while driving on long distance journeys. We are at the new plant station to find out how do they rest when they are tired on these long trips. New plant station in Accra, bustling with activities of long distance drivers. From here, one can reach every part of the country and beyond. Road safety research shows that fatigue contributes to road crashes, but drivers here would not agree to this assertion. They claim they have more fleet and so get enough rest before embarking on their journeys. At the new plant station branch number four, officers have created an avenue for drivers to rest in between their journeys. Now, like the former days, whereby when the driver comes from Kumasi or wherever, then you see the driver going back the next day or in the evening. It's not like that. A driver can come from Kumasi or Sunyan or wherever. He can spend days here because the, the fleet of buses are more now. Kofi Frimpong plies the Accra Sefi Highway, which goes through the Takradi Highway. His is the number of speed ramps. Last week, ramp. But Corona war, so not so more than The towns have been creating artificial ramps on the roads, which is bad. Drivers also worry about lack of proper road markings. What markings? The white markings are very necessary at night. The four drivers are worse culprits when it comes to excessive speeding. They claim it is a necessary evil. The big, big cars, the long vehicles, you, you, can't, you can't just follow them because then the way they drive, you know, I don't know whether they are, they are tired or whatever. But if you are just behind them or if you are at their back, if you don't take care, then you are, you are trying to follow them. You, 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 I mean, you'll be late. This is car with them you know. If the car in front of me is slow, if the car in front of me is slow, I usually overtake them. Officials at the GPRTU Accra Kumasi Express Station argue that their drivers are careful and have never been involved in road crash in the last five years. We have not recorded accidents in a long while. Our drivers are very obedient. Road safety authorities say ensuring drivers get rest is important to avoid road crashes. The transport unions agree to this, but can only advise since they don't travel with drivers. But a state-managed company, STC, has a way of checking this. Deputy Managing Director Technical, Engineer John Ewuku, says the speed governors on every vehicle has been locked up to 100 kilometers per hour. So the driver doesn't even have the, the, the freedom to drive over, I mean, over speed. You cannot go beyond 100 kilometers. We make sure that for the long hauls, we don't put drivers who, do not, who are not conversant with the route. For a route that is also beyond three, 300 kilometers, we put two drivers. Ghana, a few days ago, lost over 30 people in a road crash at Dompuasi on the Akratakradi Highway. Road safety authorities say close to 3,000 persons die in road crashes annually. Now, let's look at some statistics from the Road Safety Commission on accident cases from January to December 2019. For cases reported from January to December 2019, 13,877, which is a 1.70% uh, increase as compared to 
2018. 22,789 vehicles were involved, and that is a 3.4% increase. With persons killed in road accidents, there appear to be a negative 2.4% decrease, and persons injured involved 14,397,000 people, which is a 5.3% increase as compared to 2018. And there was also a negative 8.4% reduction uh, in pedestrian knockdown in 2019 as compared to 2018. So r road safety is a shared responsibility. We all have a role to play in it, and so we need to stay safe out there on the road.